Did you know that one in two men and one in three women are projected to develop cancer during their lifetime? Staggering, isn't it? This is the harsh reality we face today. Cancer, this insidious disease has become a global epidemic, sparing no demographic or region. It's a silent battle that millions are fighting, often unbeknownst to them. The crucial factor we often overlook, however, is the significant role our diet plays in this equation. What we consume daily can either put us on a path towards this life-altering disease, or steer us clear of it. The power of prevention lies largely in our plates, in the choices we make at the grocery store, at restaurants, and in our kitchens. From processed meats to sugary drinks, some foods increase our cancer risk more than others. It's high time we become more mindful of our dietary habits. Remember, the food choices we make daily can dramatically alter our chances of developing cancer. First on our list of cancer-causing foods is processed meats. When we say processed meats, we're talking about those tantalizing hot dogs, deli slices, and bacon strips. But what makes them a health hazard? Well, the answer lies in their preparation. These meats undergo various processes like smoking, curing, or adding preservatives. Such methods introduce harmful chemicals into the meat, some of which are known carcinogens agents that can cause cancer. Let's consider a case study. John, a middle-aged man, loved his daily dose of sausages and bacon. Over the years his consumption of processed meats led to the development of colorectal cancer, a disease directly linked to processed meat intake. Thankfully John is now in remission after making significant dietary changes. The link between processed meats and cancer is clear. The World Health Organization even classifies processed meats as a group 1 carcinogen, putting it in the same category as asbestos and tobacco. Be mindful of your processed meat intake, your health could depend on it. Next up, the sweet, menace, sugary drinks. It's a common misconception that these refreshing beverages are harmless. The truth is, they're loaded with sugars that can lead to obesity, type 2 diabetes, and heart disease. But did you know they're also linked to certain types of cancer? Yes, that's right. The high sugar content can cause inflammation in your body, leading to cell damage and potentially cancer. Let's consider the case of Jane Doe, a 40-year-old woman who had a habit of consuming three cans of soda daily. Sadly, Jane was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, a type that has been associated with high sugar intake. After her diagnosis, Jane drastically reduced her sugar consumption and noticed a significant improvement in her health. This story underlines the deceptive danger of sugary drinks. So, next time you reach for that soda, or energy drinks, think twice. Remember, not everything sweet is good for your health. Coming up, the hidden threat in our diet's fried foods. They're crispy, they're golden, they're delicious, and unfortunately they pose a substantial risk to our health. These seemingly harmless treats are often cooked at high temperatures, causing harmful compounds such as acrylamide to form. These compounds, once ingested, can increase the risk of developing various types of cancer. Consider the case of John, a man in his 40s who loved his fried chicken and french fries. After years of indulging, he was diagnosed with colon cancer. His doctors attributed this in part to his high intake of fried foods. Fortunately, after a lifestyle overhaul that included swapping out fried foods for healthier alternatives, John's health improved significantly. So, the next time you're tempted by that golden crispy exterior, remember what's at stake. Fried foods may taste good, but the potential risk they pose is far from appetizing. It's time to rethink that order of fries. Now let's talk about the silent killer, alcohol. Imagine this, a middle-aged man, let's call him John, enjoys a glass of wine with his dinner every night. Over time, this seemingly harmless habit evolves into a more regular intake. Unbeknownst to him, each sip is slowly increasing his risk of developing cancer. You see, alcohol, despite its social acceptability, has a dark side. It's a known carcinogen that's linked to various types of cancer, including breast, mouth, throat, esophagus, and mostly liver cancer. The more you drink, the higher the risk. And it's not just heavy drinking that's problematic. Even moderate drinking can have significant health implications over time. John's story isn't unique. Many of us are unaware of the health risks associated with regular alcohol consumption, but knowledge is power. By understanding the connection between alcohol and cancer, we can make informed decisions about our health. It's crucial to understand the role alcohol plays in our health. Next, we delve into the sneaky culprit in our diets, refined grains. Refined grains are like the stealthy villains in our food world. They may look innocent, but they're far from it. These grains have been stripped of their natural nutritious elements like fiber, leaving them with high levels of starch that can spike blood sugar levels. 
Now, you might be wondering, how does this connect to cancer? Well, consistent high blood sugar levels can lead to inflammation and insulin resistance, both of which are linked to an increased risk of certain cancers. Let's consider the case of Jane. She was a lover of white bread and pasta, unaware of their potential harm. After a routine checkup she was diagnosed with colon cancer. Her doctor suggested a diet change replacing refined grains with whole grains. A year into this change, Jane's health improved significantly. Remember, refined grains might be convenient but they come at a cost. Choose whole grains for a healthier life. Scene script. Let's quickly go through the remaining 13 cancer-causing foods you should avoid. Number 1 on our list is preserved pickles. Studies have found that the high salt content in preserved pickles can lead to stomach cancer. Countries where preserved pickles are a staple like Korea and Japan have seen a correlation between a high consumption of these pickles and increased rates of gastric cancer. Next up is farmed fish. While fish is generally a healthy choice, farmed fish are often raised in crowded conditions and are exposed to pesticides and other harmful chemicals which can increase the risk of liver cancer. Third on our list is hydrogenated oils. These oils are chemically altered to improve shelf life, but the process also creates trans fats. Consuming trans fats can lead to inflammation and an increased risk of colorectal cancer. Next we have microwave popcorn. The issue here lies not with the popcorn itself, but with the lining of the bags which can release a toxic chemical when heated. This chemical has been associated with testicular and kidney cancers. The fifth item is non-organic fruits and vegetables. Non-organic fruits can be treated with pesticides and other chemicals, and these residues can remain on the fruit even after washing. Long-term exposure to these chemicals can lead to a variety of cancers. Next is diet foods. While they may seem like a healthy choice, many diet foods are loaded with artificial sweeteners and other chemicals, which can increase the risk of numerous cancers. Seventh on our list is canned foods. The issue here is with the cans themselves which are often lined with a chemical linked to breast and prostate cancers. Next, we have processed white flour. The refining process strips away nutrients and leaves a product that can rapidly raise blood sugar levels, leading to an increased risk of pancreatic cancer. Number 9 is canned tomatoes, due to the chemical lining in the cans, may leach a compound linked to heart diseases, diabetes, and cancer. Next up, dairy products, such as milk and cheese, have been associated with an increased risk of ovarian, prostate, and possibly breast cancers. But further research is needed to understand the relationship. Eleventh on our list is artificial sweeteners. While they may seem like a healthier alternative to sugar, artificial sweeteners have been linked to an increased risk of bladder and brain cancers. Finally, we have burnt or heavily barbecued foods. The high heat used in these cooking methods can cause the formation of carcinogenic compounds, increasing the risk of stomach and colorectal cancers. Knowledge is power, and now you're equipped to make healthier food choices. Now that we've uncovered these cancer-causing foods, what's next, you might be asking yourself? The answer lies in the power of informed decision-making. We've traversed a vast landscape of dietary dangers today, from processed meats and sugary drinks to fried foods, alcohol, and refined grains. And we've discovered 13 more culprits all stealthily hiding in our daily meals. But remember, knowledge is power. Now that we're armed with this crucial information, we can make healthier choices and significantly reduce our cancer risk. Just think about it by simply swapping out that sugary soda for a refreshing glass of water, or replacing those fried chicken wings with a nourishing baked chicken breast. We're not just enhancing our health today, we're investing in our future. We're choosing a life less burdened by disease, more abundant in vitality, and enriched with the peace of mind that comes from knowing we're doing our best to protect ourselves and our loved ones. Now this information is far too important to keep to ourselves. We all have friends, family members, colleagues, and loved ones who could benefit from these insights. So, let's get the word out there, share this video with them. Let's start a conversation about how we can collectively fight cancer, one healthy choice at a time. And while you're at it, why not subscribe to our channel? We're constantly digging deep into a myriad of health topics, uncovering truths, dispelling myths, and providing practical, actionable advice that can truly make a difference in your life. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we release new content. And if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. This simple action can help us reach more people, fostering a healthier and more informed community. Let's fight cancer with our plates, one healthy choice at a time. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more health insights. Stay healthy, stay informed.